The tea leaves said I'm going to get married and soon. Well, since when do you need Tabitha's tea leaves to tell you that you and Ethan are going to get married? Everyone already knows that you're engaged. Well, it's nice to just have it confirmed. I mean, you never know what could happen between now and my wedding day. <laughs> could and will, Teresa. Tea leaves again, Tabitha. Well, if you like, dear. <laughs> Does it say when I'm going to marry Ethan? I mean, I mean, will it be soon? It looks as if your wedding day is just around the corner, Teresa. Oh my! What did you hear that? I'm going to be a bride. All my dreams are about to come true. <laughs> More like your worst nightmare, dear. Oh okay. All right. Who's next? Don't even look at me, okay? I've had enough fortune telling to last me a lifetime. After that awful fortune teller at the carnival, please. What? But that was like two years ago. I don't care. Look, I think we've really been here long enough. I want to go check on my dad and Chad and see how they're doing. Yeah, I'm really worried about Luis and Ethan. Well, so am I. But you know, if something had happened, well, well we would have known. We can see straight into the Bennett's yard from here. Now, now, if we go back, we'll, we'll only get in the way. Oh, 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 are you all right? Oh, 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 it's, oh, it's just my heart. I, I'm afraid it's working overtime tonight. All these harrowing goings on next door. Oh, why don't I just go get my mom? Oh no, 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 no! Please, please don't. It's, it's just one of my little turns. I know. I'll, I'll be fine, dear. <laughs> Do you see something else about Ethan and me? Well, no, actually. This is about the three of you. Tabitha, what do the tea leaves say about the three of us? I, it's coming a bit clearer now. Something about a double wedding. I can't believe it. That's exactly what my fortune cookie predicted too. I was there. Okay, so I'm definitely one of the brides that's getting married. But who's going to be the other bride, Tabitha? Will it be Sheridan or Whitney? You can really tell which one of us is going to be getting married along with Teresa? Oh, the answers are all right here, dear. It's just a question of interpreting them correctly. Well, I don't care what any tea leaves have to say. I know that I'm not going to be the other bride. I mean, Chad and I are definitely not ready for that level. We're not getting married. <laughs> Maybe you just don't know that you are, Whit. Oh, give me a break, please. I'll get the tea leaves a break. Now, they said that I'm going to get married soon, and I am. And now they're predicting a double wedding, just like my fortune cookie did? This, this is not a coincidence. Now, you know, this if you say fate, I swear I will tape your mouth shut forever. Do you understand me? Okay, I won't say the word. Do you know what I'm thinking? Tabitha, will you read Whitney's tea leaves? Is she going to be the other bride when I get married? Oh, will you look at that? How very revealing. You know what? These are just tea leaves. They don't mean anything. What if they're so meaningless? Why are you scared? I'm not scared. I just don't believe in this kind of stuff. You know what? I'm going back to the Bennetts to see what's going on. This is... <laughs> you know, I'll come with you. Uh, Sheridan. Just, just let her go. Wait, you want to know if you're going to be the other bride? It'll only take a minute, dear. I can't believe I'm putting any faith in this after every experience I've had with predictions has been negative. Oh, just forget about that stupid fortune cookie that you had tonight. Actually, I wasn't even thinking about that. The first time I ever had my fortune told, I was a little girl. I was playing in the park with my nanny, and there was this old woman sitting on a bench. And she was just staring at me. You know, it scared me, because I thought she was a witch. Oh, <laughs> there you go, little girl. Would you like a balloon? Oh, no, my nanny says I'm not supposed to take things from strangers. Ah. Uh. If only that would protect you, child. I regret to tell you, 
that one day your heart is going to be broken in love. I haven't thought about that in so long. Actually, the woman looked just like you, Tabitha. Did she not? But that couldn't be. She was very old at the time. <laughs> yes, well, all old people look the same to a young girl. Whoever she was, she was right. I've had my heart broken so many times, I've lost count. But you've never been truly in love before, Louise. That's why I think you could be the other bride at my double wedding. Now, Tabitha, what do Sheridan's tea leaves say? Tabitha, will Sheridan and Louise be the other couple at my double wedding? Can you say anything? Just, just give me a minute, dear, to make sense of this. Did you see that? What? I, I could swear I just saw Tabitha's doll scooting out of the room. Oh, don't be silly, dear. Timmy's just where I left him. Oh, I can't stand the suspense. Is Sheridan going to be the other bride? Hmm. I see Sheridan on a sunny beach. It's a foreign country, I think. Is it Spain? Well, it must be. Do you know what that means? That you and Louise are going to honeymoon in the same place you were sending Ethan and me. Well, I, I can't say for certain that it's Spain, but, uh, but you are with a man, Sheridan. Well, if he's tall, dark, and handsome, that's my brother, Luis. <sighs> it better be. <laughs> yes, yes, the man is Luis. I knew it! Sheridan is in Spain with Luis on their honeymoon. Is that what you're seeing, Tabitha? <laughs> Yes, yes, now I see it. Sheridan and Louise on their honeymoon. Oh, now, do you believe me that you and Louise are going to be the other bride and groom along with Ethan and me at our wedding? I don't know, Teresa. I... Oh, what more proof do you need, Sheridan? More than a tea leaf reading. No offense, Tabitha. But if I'm not going to believe what my fortune cookie said, that I'm not about to put stock in this. I mean, no one can predict the future. And I was raised that way, too, but... Well, don't think of it as, as fortune-telling. Think of it as destiny. Now, these tea leaves are simply telling you that you and Louise are meant to end up together just like Ethan and I are. Well, Tabitha said that she saw Louise and me on our honeymoon, but she didn't say when. Huh? You listen carefully, Sheridan. See if I can narrow it down for you. Well, it looks as if it's going to take place in a matter of weeks. Wow. You see? That's when Ethan and I are going to get married, and it looks like you are, too. I can't wait to tell them. Oh, I just hope that they're all right. <sighs> Tabitha, thank you so much for everything, and we'll just go out the back way. <sighs> you wouldn't thank me if you knew what else was in store for you, Teresa. Little does Teresa know that her wedding day will be the most miserable 24 hours of her life. <laughs> True, Sheridan and Louise will be honeymooning on a sunny beach. Trouble is, she'll be dead 